Tissue loss and organ failure as a result of disease and injury is a substantial health problem throughout the world. Transplantation can restore functionality, but there's a critical donor shortage. Most surgical therapies aimed at addressing these problems don't totally restore functionality to these tissues. One of the main goals of my lab is trying to regenerate these tissues using the patient's own cells in order to regain this functionality. One of the ways we do this is by developing novel biomaterial systems and microenvironments to present specific signals to cells in order to enhance the rate and quality of new tissue formation. We try to draw upon how tissues form during development and during healing processes. We design new materials, we characterize them, we try to understand how cells interact with these materials outside of the body. So there are a number of different uh, signals that influence what cells do. These include soluble signals like growth factors, uh, insoluble signals like the extracellular matrix that surrounds cells, and also uh, cells communicate with each other. And so we're currently developing biomaterials that can present some of these signals individually and in combination in order to try to understand their impact on cell behavior. And ultimately, for our most promising technologies, we take them in vivo to see whether they're capable of repairing specific tissues of, of interest. The main benefit is to try to restore functionality to, to these tissues that either have been lost or no longer function correctly. One of the projects that we're really excited about uh, involves the assembly of stem cells into high cell density masses. So cells can interact with each other through cell-cell adhesions and form self-containing structures in the shape of spheres or sheets and so we're applying this to engineer a variety of tissues such as bone and cartilage, vascular tissue. Oftentimes due to disease or injury, the trachea will stenose or be closed up. And so we're using molds to form donut-shaped mesenchymal stem cell uh, constructs to engineer the trachea and delivering signals within these donut constructs. By stringing constructs onto a tube, these donuts will fuse to form cylinders in the shape of the trachea. And these tissues have the mechanical integrity uh, similar to that of the native trachea. Some of the research we're doing may ultimately contribute to improving people's lives, aiding in their ability to perform daily activities or decrease any pain that they're experiencing.